Let's kill Nurse Nancy. Um, let's go put some torches on our, whoa, on our ramp. Where, <laughs> that's right. I shoot you with the bow and you attack the tree because it's actually the tree's fault. It's not my fault. It's the tree's fault. back everybody to 70s and i have an old guy gaming and in this episode we're gonna craft a couple of things and then let's see if we can knock out the luigi's pizza tier 2 quest uh before nightfall uh okay so i went out and looted or not looted i'm sorry uh salvaged i went went out and did a bunch of salvaging because i needed uh mechanical parts in particular and in the process we got the final spear magazine So yeah, that's really OP. We kill a zombie with a spear and it come instantly fills our stamina bar all the way back up. It's really, really nice. And let's see, we also got another level and I put that into Deadeye. Okay, and so now what we're going to do is we are going to make nine mineral waters because I got uh, the water, the chrysanthemum, goldenrod, and some coal. Uh, so I've already favorite, favorited that. It's going to take 11 minutes and 28 seconds. There we go. Okay. I'm going to put this coal in the food chest because that's going to be used specifically for mineral water. Uh, let's take a red tea right now because uh, we need a little bit of hydration there. Uh, I've made nine hobo stews, so we got that going on. I need to make one more... Um, one more uh, armor pocket mod thingy. So here, let's see, what do we need for that? Alright, so we need plastic, leather, duct tape, mechanicals, and sewing kits. Okay, and then, um, oh, here, that'll be done in a couple of seconds. Let's just wait for it. Wait for it. And we'll put that on our uh, boots. And that opens up this whole this next whole row and so we just have this row left to to do but even if we fill this row up you know we're not quite as encumbered as we would have been otherwise um and then you know as we come across better ones we'll just swap them out uh, i have a, a double here that we looted all the clothing items have pocket mods and then these all have the singles because that's what we can make all right now we also uh, because of the fact that we got a whole bunch of, in fact, you know what, I need to put, I'm going to keep a stack of five brass radiators because we need that for crafting like the turbo mod and some stuff. The rest of these we're just going to melt down into the forge here. Um, all right, so what we're going to do is we're going to make a whole bunch of lock picks. We have 11 on us. Why don't we... Well, let's not go batshit crazy with this. Let's make... Um, if we make 6... 14... If we make 14 more, then that'll give us 25. So that's a half stack. And then we can just start, you know, hitting safes and police cars, whatever. Um, we don't have to play the little, the little game anymore uh, with the police cars. So a lock pick, let's favorite this. Or no, right here. And we'll make. Oh. Wait a second. That's not a one-to-one -one ratio, huh? Alright, well let's make No, that's right. That's what we want to do. Never mind. Yeah, it is a one-to-one. -one. Cool. Okay, we'll put this stuff back in here. 
I uh, got a bunch of car batteries. I've got I got two more engines. I went and wrenched um, street lamps. Got a little more steel there. We had 25 already from a reward. And uh, we're still sitting at 119 mechanical parts even after all of that. So that's pretty good. I do uh, I do and will and need to uh, put a, a point into salvage ops at some point uh, too, and that might even be our next point. <clears throat> we'll see how things go. Uh, but as far as our skills go, let's see, we're about 20% of the way into the next level. Uh, but we now have one point in combat. Or, I'm sorry, in dead eye. We have one point in boomstick. We have one point in machine gunner. We have one point in archery and gunslinger. Uh, so, yeah, that gives us a, at least that first point in, in each of the weapon types. So we can be just a little bit more effective. And then, of course, our spear is our star weapon. <clears throat> That's where we're, we're the most effective. Uh, let's see. If we look at that, we are four points away, or four magazines away from being able to make a level five spear. But if I come across, you know, if the trader is selling a steel spear, even if it's just a level one, We'll probably end up seeing if we can buy it because um, the steel spear is just that much better. Okay, so I think that kind of gets uh, us caught up to where everything is. Uh, oh, you know, the other thing we needed the mechanical parts for too. Oh, no, wait a minute. Never mind. I'm thinking of something. I'm probably thinking of Undead Legacy. Uh, we might want to actually think about selling. I mean, we get 800 bucks for just one purple battery. And um, so we might want to think about selling one of those. In fact, speaking of which, why don't we do that? Um, in fact, I mean, the only reason, the only thing a purple battery does for you is it gives you better. Um, it works better in a battery bank. I'm not even entirely sure how to be honest with you now that I think about it, but I guess it charges faster maybe or something. But for vehicle crafting, it doesn't matter what the quality of the battery is. So I'm thinking maybe we sell both of these and maybe we'll just keep those just, um, you know, just so we can make, make some money here. Um, so this is all the stuff that I have to sell. But... If we're going to do that quest, we need to get going like now. It is, it is getting late. So let's grab those mineral waters. Uh, let's see. We got bandages. We've got honey. And we got ammo. Okay, yeah, let's go do this. This Luigi, Luigi's quest. It's just right up the street here. Uh, we had a wandering horde come in too, so they're just kind of across the street there. But it, they haven't come over to the house, so I've been ignoring them. Okay, so this is just a clear quest. Let's do it. Yep, full stamina bar. It's a beautiful thing. What the hell? Okay, nothing over here. Let's check these. Nice. You know, I loot those um, Mega Crushes, and I almost never actually use them. I have used them in the past, though. Kitchen action. And some yo action. Some dead yo. We sure are finding a lot of cooking magazines, and that's a good thing. Not complaining about that at all. Uh, this will take its cell. We don't care about that. Uh, sure, why not? I'll take some coal. All right. Anything else I'm missing in here? I'm kind of in hurry mode here, so... That door's locked. Okay, let's head on up this way. That door's unlocked. That 
doors unlocked. Uh oh. <laughs> I, uh. Take a shotgun, asshole. I left my wood at home. Give me a full stamina bar. Okay, well, I think we probably we got an abrasion, so let's take one of those. And dude dropped a blue bag. Let's see what we get. Pretty decent stuff overall. We'll take it. Okay. Let's go in here. Oh, yeah. Let's get this reloaded. Don't see anything uh, real substantial in here as far as looting goes. Some toilet paper. All right. We don't need that shit. In fact, you know what? We're going to throw that up, too. And... Um, let's just eat these now. And uh, we're going to actually take a mineral water. We get 60 water from one of those, plus um, the efficient digestion buff to, that the red tea gives, too. And what else did we get from that? Oh, and it's got the same, yeah, it's got the same effect as um, goldenrod tea. The mineral water is good stuff, man. All right, this is where Larry the Lumberjack came out of. That's just going to be cornmeal. Uh, there's some food there. Nice. Okay, I think we're going to skip all of this loot. Let's go up to the next level. See a red dot that way. Okay, let's load in here real quick. Fish tacos. Let's look at that real quick. Nice. Chili dogs next, and then sham chowder. Sham chowder is some really good stuff. Check the dishwasher. And the sink. I guess we'll already checked that. Right. Somebody woke up here. Is this a bathroom? Yep. Okay, let's keep moving here. Guess that's supposed to be a big mirror. Up on the roof we go. Last time we went up on the roof, that damn thing caved in. We're going to stay along the side this time. Are we supposed to go in here? That door's locked. Let's go around this way. Okay. I think I see an Arlene down there. There's a buzzard. See two more red dots. Businessman. Also be a buzzard. Is 
It's over this way more, though. Maybe inside this building here? It's you! I get to his head. All right, you know what? Just come out. Quit screwing around. Oh. You supposed to go down this way? I don't know. Let's go down the stairs. One of those deals, huh? Oh, I guess this is the same room. One way or to other. Beef guts. Me so. Try to see if we can see any enemies out there. Were we in here before? If we did, we didn't loot this. Do not believe we were. Nice. Actually, I don't think we weren't down in here either. I'm kind of confused about the pathing of this place, to be honest with you. Wait, were we in here? Check the kitchen. That's it for in here. Can't go that way. Okay, so if we come back down here, oh, look at that. Nice. How are we supposed to get back up without pulling? Or maybe, maybe that's, I don't know. You don't usually, the the game design, at least from vanilla, doesn't usually have you pull, nerd pull to get somewhere. Wait, is this open? Do we look at this? Yeah, that's locked. Okay, well, because time is short, we better just move. Let's just take the path of least resistance here. Oh. of those okay let's go so you want us to jump over here eh, let's not jump let's just play this one safe oh is this a different that's a different poi okay no we don't want to go over there wait do we We gotta stay in Luigi's. Yeah, Luigi's Pizza. Okay. Well, that was not the correct way to go. Uh, all right. So where do we go from here? We went in that bedroom. Ah, here we go. Okay. No, we came. We came through this door. I'm corn fused.
Where in the heck are we supposed to go? Alright, let's bust through the... Oh shit, a thousand hit points? Seriously? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> um, obviously not that way. We've been in here already. I mean, it seems like it wants you to go this way, but that's a different POI. That's not Luigi's Pizza. That's why I'm confused here. Maybe we are supposed to go back down this way. It goes into the bathroom. Oh, yeah, I, that's right. We got to go downstairs now because we we're on the other. Gotcha. Okay. Now I understand what's going on. I don't know where all those zombos are coming from. They're not showing up as red dots. Gotta free up a little inventory space here. That we can scrap. <clears throat> Let's eat the miso. Dealt with them. More water. We're going to go in here and we're going to get rushed. You know what? I think it's time to repair this. And guess who didn't bring any repair kits? Oh my goodness, I hope it lasts for the rest of this. They're going to come out of here. I'll bet you. Oh, maybe? Maybe not. We're done. Okay, let's get the fat loots. Man, we are almost out of time. I've done nothing to make sure this building is secure. So we gotta hurry. Nice. Uh, but that's not the fat loots. This is the fat loot. Oh shit. What the hell, Big Mama? You know what? This has lots of healing. 80. Let's use it. Okay. Things were a little hectic there, so I didn't see exactly what we got, but... This is nice, the armor plating mod. But I think I... I guess all that went into our inventory, right? Okay, got an exit here. Let's get on our bike and get out of here. We'll have to do the turn in tomorrow. I'm not going to make it back in time for that. All right, Luigi's Pizza is done. So, um... I think what I'll do, guys, is I'll cut the camera here. I'll come back in the morning. And by the way, tomorrow is Horde Night 21, too. And then uh, we'll we'll do the. Uh, I'll bring you back in the morning, and we'll do the turn in, so you can see what we get. Okay, guys, it's morning. Um, we're gonna grab all of this stuff in here to sell to Jen and bring in some good bank. Uh, I am keeping my eye open for, I, I think I mentioned this already, for a steel spear, but I also want to get a real shotgun, too. 
Uh, double barrel would be nice, but pump shotgun would be really nice. Um, so, yeah, because uh, we got a real pistol, quote unquote. We got a real machine gun, quote unquote. Excuse me. Um, so we just need to get the, the pipe shotgun upgraded. Uh, okay, so yeah, let's let's go ahead and set out and do that. I've had a had a running horde uh, come in, and they've been kind of wandering around all night. So just stayed quiet, went AFK, um, started editing this video, did a couple other things, uh, waiting for my. Oh shoot! You know what? We can't go. We can't go do that yet because she's not open. All right, I'm going to do something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what. I'll do something, and then I'll I'll meet you at the trader at uh, 6 a.m. to finish out the video. Maybe I'll just kill some Zeeks or something to get some some more XP going here. We're about halfway to the next level. Oh, you know what we could do actually? Well, here let's kill let's kill Nurse Nancy. Um, let's go put some torches on our whoa on our ramp. <laughs> That's right. I shoot you with the bow. And you attack the tree because it's actually the tree's fault. It's not my fault. It's the tree's fault. I lied to her. I don't think she realized it. Though. Anyway. <laughs> oh, geez. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go throw some torches down on the, the stair. So that way, when we start Horde Night tonight, uh, we'll be able to... Whoa. Okay, watch my stamina bar. All the way back. That is so OP. I love it, though. I'm not complaining. Uh, all right, yeah, torches. Ooh, they did a little bit of damage here. Need some cobblestone to fix that. Uh, I mentioned this a long time ago, but if, in case you're wondering why I haven't um, upgraded these stairs, I'm not entirely sure that I'm going to keep them there, so that's why... I have not done that yet. Um, all right, so torches. We are gonna need some animal fat. Got 18. I am using this for cooking though, too, so I don't want to use too much of it. Let's grab three of those. And we need some cloth as well. Which we have lots of. And then I think I have. Uh, I already have two more torches yet, because I was, was going to actually go put those put those in place. Okay, put, put those there, and then uh, we're making the torches here. And we're just going to put those along the stairs so we can kind of see a little bit better if the horse is coming up. Let's deal with this Yahoo first. Excuse me, goodness gracious sakes alive, I just blew my brains out from sneezing. Let's take a look actually down here. They're, they are doing a number on the place. It's not, I don't think we need to worry about it yet, but we might need to do a little bit of shoring up. Nice headshot. Hey, give me my arrow back. Guess we're not, guess there's no getting that arrow back. Ronnie McDonnie, what are you doing down in my moat? It's not finished yet. Okay, so we got rid of those yahoos. Let's go put our torches up. I do have a little bit of concrete, but the problem with upgrading a block to concrete when you can't make it yourself is that if, then you need more concrete to keep it repaired. So I'm not so sure... Oh, <laughs> that rabbit. Get him. Okay, that rabbit deserves to live. He deserves to live, so we're going to let him. Okay, so um, let's put a torch here. If we put it down too low, they, they, might, they might damage it. Put one there too. Okay, now let's go up. Uh, 
Let's go up a, a ways. I mean, it's kind of hard to say exactly how far up to go, but maybe say right here. And then we'll just... Uh, we're going to have to... Go out here so we can... Put one there. I'm, I'm, I'm being a little bit stingy, I guess, with the animal fat, but uh, I don't have a ton of it, and we need it for you know, some of the better dishes. Okay, well, this will light up, you know, we, we, we really just need to kind of see what's happening down below, because as long as I can see the zombies are getting up on the ramp uh, and coming up to us, it doesn't matter, because the closer they get to us, the higher they get, the closer they get to us, the better I can see anyway. So it's really just down here that matters the most. So, all right, well, um... I su yeah, I could have made one more, I suppose. Maybe I will. And somewhere in the middle between the two that I put in place, like that block right there-ish, maybe we'll do a couple there too, right before the Horde Night starts. Um, but, yeah, this, this base design, what time is it? It's 5.37. Yeah, she's going to open pretty quick. This base design is actually working very well, except for the fact that it's difficult for me to safely repair it. So, yeah, that's the, that's the, the kind of the downside to it, I guess. We're going to use um, more explosives. I'm going to make some pipe bombs for Horde Knight because we can get a, a lot of XP very quickly uh, doing that. And, uh, we, you know, we'll have some Molotovs. In fact, I'm starting to carry the Molotovs anyways because from now on, when we do infested quests, we need to have at least Molotovs, if not pipe bombs, with us. So, okay, well, Jen's just about open, so I'll, I'll meet you guys inside when uh, when we can get in there. Hi, Jen. We've got the best prices in the wasteland. I know you do. That's what you says, too. Here's though. your pay for a job well done. Ooh, hunting rifle. That would be nice. Um, Actually, our purple pipe rifle does more damage than that, though. Uh, the thing about this, though, is we can fire off multiple shots. Uh, it's, it has a faster fire rate, is what I'm trying to say. Oh, boy. Let's see. Three first aid Big first aid kits would be very nice, but um, I would take this, but this, you know, this just does quite a bit more damage. It really honestly does. Um, the serrated blade mod would be kind of nice, but I think we better go for this because this is going to continue to help us advance. So we're going to go with the uh, skill magazines. Okay. Now let's go into your uh, to our inventory, and we're gonna sell these items to you. We're currently sitting at seven thousand one hundred fifty-six coin. Now we're at ten thousand five hundred and two. Let's see. We have two salvage tool, and now we can do wrench quality three, which we'll do. <clears throat> Excuse me. A couple of club crafting, which we don't care about so much, and then a couple of rifles. All right, Jen. Uh, what do you got for jobs? You don't have any. Uh, shoot, she doesn't have any um, infestations. Yeah. I always admired a hard worker. <laughs> I don't think we've done Mason's bargain yet. Back so soon. Let's do that. And I'll have a nice reward for you. All right, I tell you what we're gonna do. Um, let's run over to. Let's run over to Hugh real quick. And uh, he wants us to do this quest anyways, but we don't have time to do that in this episode. But let's at least just, just go over there and see what he has in his inventory. And then what we'll probably do is wrap up this episode here, and then we'll start the next episode by doing that quest for him. Hey, Hugh. Nah. All right, dude. Shotgun, I need one. Got a blue hunting rifle. You don't have any shotguns, huh? 
Well, you kind of suck, dude. All right, shit. Um, magazine extender mod. It's got a ratchet. That'd be nice to have. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Okay, yeah, whatever. All right, guys, well, we're gonna have to wrap up this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you want to share out the video. And uh, we'll start up the next episode uh, with this POI off yonder here that uh, Trader Hugh wants us to do. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.